All right. Um, so, ladies and gentlemen, the, an important thing when when we are writing a when we're writing a number in scientific notation, um, the first thing we remember that we have to have when we're doing scientific notation. Remember, we have a times ten um, to the b power. Where remember a has to be between one and ten. So, actually, we write it like this. It can be greater than or le or equal to one, but it can it has to be less than ten. All right, it has to be less than ten. So, JT, what I would do since we're having an issue since our talk, is I would make sure I put my decimal point between the 4 and um, the 9. All right? So I'm going to now rewrite my problem as 4.97. Do you guys see how that w that's the only place I can put the decimal point where my a would be between 1 and 10? Does everybody see that? No. Now what we pretty much need to say, now what we need to account for is currently right now, the decimal point is over here. So if I'm going to rewrite the decimal point over there, how, how, many, how, many decimal point, how many spaces do I need to move it so it goes back to its original? And then you basically just count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So since we're moving our decimal point to go to take it um, to back, if, we, if here is our problem of scientific notation, if we need to move it 10 spaces to the right to go back to our original, that's going to be a positive. Five. Okay, 